in today's video, I will teach you how to change GIMP to dark theme. Let's get started. GIMP is a powerful open source image editing software that does support dark mode. First, open GIMP and access the preferences. To do this, go to the menu bar at the top of the GIMP editor and click Edit. In the drop down menu, find and select the Preferences option. In the Preferences dialog box, go to the left sidebar and look for the Interface category. Now, under the interface category, you will find two options. Theme, which can change the entire color scheme of your editor, and the icon theme, wherein you can customize the GIMP icon separately. Let's change the theme first. At the sidebar, select Theme, and here there are different theme options to choose from. We have Dark, Gray, Light, and System. Each option has a corresponding location where the files needed to change the themes are located. So if you encounter an error while changing the themes, you might want to check the files in its directory. Now, to finally change the theme, you can simply double-click on the theme that you would like to switch to. Then you will see GIMP's editor changes theme in real time. Now, if you're satisfied with the theme, you can click OK. To switch the icon theme to match your editor, go to the side panel once again and select the icon theme. Here, you have more options to choose from. You can choose from color, legacy, symbolic, symbolic high contrast, symbolic inverted, and symbolic inverted high contrast. Each icon will immediately change its theme once you double-click the theme that you would like to change to. Now, below this panel, you have the option to change the icon size depending on your preferences. In the Icon Size drop-down menu, you have the option to pair the icons with the resolution of your computer. You also have the option to pair up the icon size based on the theme of the editor and you can also manually adjust the icon size. You can make them small, medium, large, and huge and you will see the icons in the editor change while changing the size in the dialog box. Now, just play around with the optimal settings for you, and you can now click OK and go back to your newly themed GIMP interface. If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.